love to solve some of the real world problems and this can inspire me to have some ideas to other companies and also I would like to collaborate and connect with them. I already learned so much about the technologies that Alibaba provides, chance for me to expose to AI technologies. We are also very curious on how to utilize Alibaba Cloud Services because um, we are not really familiar and introduced to that. We thought that it would be a very great idea and definitely a good experience for us to anticipate joining this competition. The experience is actually very good because everyone is very professional and also like we cooperate very well when we dedicate the task and everything. So for experience here, it, it was quite nice. Everything was very, very, actually very packed. And the way that I think I liked the most was how we have the hackathon room and the speaker speaking at the same place so we don't have to move back and forth. We can choose to listen and the mentors are going around. So we have our own space and all the information is just around us. There are plenty of freshmen I think that smooth out the entire event. So we could just really focus on our product, leave at six and you know, keep working back and coming back the next day. So we developed Funside AI to actually help to solve problems such as startup owners who actually require uh, grants and we provide grant recommendation and fund insight for them to analyse it. Alright, so the project we're working on is InsurScan where it is a service provided to the insurance company itself help them streamline process claims where we do several checks, we, we do document checks, we do the damage assessment, we do car model check and also we do 3D model cost checking. Yeah, so these are special features in InsurScan that streamlines the process of insurance claims. Like anything, we have different style of solve the problem. So the most most important one is our team will like they want to add some feature and some of them have different ideas so we need to make sure that our scope is the same we all met uh, in Discord actually. We are not like planned together, so like it was quite special for us as well. Like we couldn't believe that we even got into top 13. In a way, we had this inner feeling like we will do something or win something. So that was really special for us. And I hope like maybe we can do a lot of hackathons together as a team. And I really love these people as well. Yeah. So trend just maybe is like during this short time frame, we need to like develop a very compressive solution. So we need to like uh, spend many of our times in it. So yeah, although there are many challenges, but we overcome it and I very thank you that my team is all like very good and also we are working well together. Yeah, so we need to keep our process flexible and scalable. Especially when it comes to hackathon, we have like one or two days of execution. So we have to keep it short and race if there's any obstacles. I think the challenges of course are the all participations and submissions are equally great. I think it's a tough time for us to make a decision and we have a good deliberation sessions among the judges to actually select the top three. The most important lesson that we have learned throughout this hackathon is that it is very important for us to learn about the tools before we get to use it. Without knowing the right way to use the tools, we will waste a lot of time. So I think that would be the main lesson learned for us. I think the participants should focus more on the area how to leverage AI to solve certain problems that has never been solved before prior to the AI era. You know, keep being hungry, keep pushing the boundaries really you know, test out the state of the art model and see how you can come up with solutions that are, are designed to improve people's life. Lah. So my advice for future people who want to join hackathons, be brave and be always courageous in terms of exploring new ideas and new creativity because in this world where we have all the AI being involved around our ecosystem, especially it's becoming more and more modernized, 